Our next Takeout Tuesday feature offering to go and delivery to stay open. Let's get to news through reporter Anthony Sabella live in Chesapeake. And uh, Anthony, you, you really picked a good one this morning. Hopefully they can um, give you something to go early. <laughs> Well, unfortunately, they're not open just yet, you know, but I think in this point in time, it's never too early to crack open a bottle of wine, right? So this is one of Tinto Wine and Cheese's three Hampton Roads locations. There's also one in uh, Virginia Beach, as well as in downtown Norfolk, this one here in the Edinburgh area of Chesapeake. And, you know, wine shops, they might not be what you first think of when you consider Takeout Tuesday, but this is one of several that we've been to right now, and I think that it's good to maybe always have a bottle of wine, a good bottle of wine around the house when you're stuck at home, right? So right now, uh, Tinto is still able to help customers inside, but you're not gonna find any tastings here. It's more of a to-go situation. The shop is also offering curbside pickup and delivering all over Hampton Roads too. Now the staff here at Tinto takes pride in carrying wines you won't find anywhere else. Labels mostly from Italy, Spain, Portugal, that's where the owners live, uh, but some from Virginia and the West Coast too. All are at least sustainable, if not fully organic, I'm told. And fortunately, at least right now, the co-owner, who is also the managing partner here, says business is pretty steady. Luckily for us, whether times are good or times are bad, people need a drink. And so we've had some, some really great customers that have continued to support us and in a way that allows us to keep all of our full-time employees employed. Which is really great news. You know, we haven't heard that from a lot of places we've visited over the last few weeks. But that doesn't mean adjustments haven't been made here either. Tinto is focusing a lot more on wine retail, I'm told. Although you can still get uh, delicious charcuterie boards if you do want some food from them. Now, they're also wearing masks and they're cleaning and sanitizing after every customer comes in, they told me. So a lot of work to make sure it's a clean and safe environment here inside this location and the others as well. Uh, the hours, I'm told, have changed too. Again, Tinto has three locations here in Edinburgh, Chesapeake. There's a one in the hilltop area of uh, in Virginia Beach, and then there's also one in downtown Norfolk. So three locations to choose from. We have more information on how you can get in contact with them and more information about the company in general on our website, WTKR.com. Coming up next, we're going to move to Virginia Beach at a place that we really haven't been to one of these kinds of places yet. It's a uh, vegan influence, Caribbean influence, uh, the owners from Guyana. So it's going to be a pretty interesting place, pretty unique. I'm excited to show it to you. We'll have that for you coming up next on WGNT. We're live here in Chesapeake. Anthony Sabella, News 3.